Ladies and gentlemen, it's the BS Football Forum Extravaganza National Championship Pick. Florida versus Oklahoma. Now, as, as y'all know, and before we get started, I want to thank everybody who uh, commented and watched our Florida versus Alabama SEC Championship. Really cool. comments. Thanks to Gators First for putting our video on their page for people to view, the, the Florida fans to, to send them on over to our page maybe and check out videos. We appreciate it. Hey, you know what? This is the SEC against the Big 12. Uh, we hope to get a lot of Big 12 people in and on yeah. our site. We welcome everybody. Uh, but, but, you know, we're SEC guys. Yeah. and We're not Gator haters right now. Not right now. But, I mean, if, if you're looking at this game right here, Oklahoma's kind of like the Florida of the Big 12. Yes. They, they've, they've dropped 60 points in, like, the last five games or something like that, and they're really offensively on fire. But, I mean, it's probably pretty easy to drop 60 on a Missouri team that ranked pretty bad on defense, I believe. Yes. And everybody and their brother knew that the Missouri didn't have a shot at it. <laughs> right. Uh, Oklahoma... You know, it might make the Oklahoma people mad, but I ain't going to be the first one. It's It's been said everywhere. I don't know what they're doing there. I mean, Oklahoma, I do believe, is playing great football right now. Uh, but, uh, you know, when your record's tied and somebody beats you head-to-head, -head, I'd have to give Texas the nod. That's a lot of controversy that that, that, that has caused. Um, Oklahoma, it, it was a three-way tie. It was, you know... Texas beat Oklahoma, Texas Tech beat Texas, Oklahoma beat Texas Tech. But if you look at it, when Oklahoma lost to Texas, they were number one. They dropped them to like fourth, which means they didn't drop them very far. And uh, But, I mean, that's out of our hands. We're sitting here. Oklahoma is in it against the Gators. Okay, let's, let's, let's look at these two football teams. Uh, I think Oklahoma's pretty balanced on offense. They can run the football and they can pass the football. And they got that Bradford. He's a pretty good quarterback. Going for the Heisman. We'll find out soon whether he gets it or not. Yeah. And the Heisman to me is a joke. It really don't mean yes. anything. Um, even though Tebow did win the Heisman, there's been a. It seems like the Heisman's more political now than than anything. To me, that's my opinion. Yeah, it really is a bunch of crap. <laughs> but anyway, um. And you got Florida. We've seen Florida firsthand. Those guys, I'm sure they'll have Percy Harvin back off the ankle injury. He ain't gonna be 100. percent I don't think. If it was a bad sprain, he ain't gonna if be. If it's real bad, I've sprained my ankle many times in little league football. You were an all star. Hey, it's hell. Anyways, now you you can't recover fully in just a matter of weeks or a month. I'm telling you, if it's real bad. I don't know how bad, bad it was, but if you can get him back, man, he's an awesome player. But in the SEC championship game, if you're a Florida fan, do you sit there and say, I would rather be without Tebow or be without Harvin? I think uh, you wouldn't have won that game if Tebow was out. No, dude, you got to have Tebow. There's no doubt about it. He's like the uh, driving – the force. force that keeps that team together. So, I mean, really, honestly, yeah, Harvin was a big shot to the to the team, but Tebow, you can't go without him. But but that's the thing. Uh, Florida went in the SEC championship and beat the number one uh, Alabama Crimson Tide without him. They're that good. Yeah. And at time, that game was a real good game. It was one of the best games I've probably watched this year. Besides the Texas and Texas Tech game, that's probably the number one top game of the year. Last second score, anyway. Yeah. Um, you know, Oklahoma, they, they've, they've looked unstoppable before. Right. And uh, they've gotten beat. Well, I think that uh, they've put that behind them, and I think they're – they're, but look at how they're winning now. They're killing people. They're killing people. But Florida was too, you know. I don't think that – you look at Alabama, that was a lot tougher conference finals than You're Missouri. The number one team. The number one team. So, Florida can do it all, though, man. They're so quick. Uh, 
Bob Stoops, former defensive coordinator at Florida. He's a – I don't like him. I'll be honest, I don't like Bob Stoops. Yeah, I don't much care for him either. Sorry. Hold on. That's him. Stoops so, Bob, hold on for a second, if you don't mind. But, uh, yeah, what do you think about this game? I'm thinking that Florida – needs to hold on to the foot. They don't need to turn it over. They need – Tebow has to execute like he has been doing ever since the Ole Miss loss. He's executed. He's brought them out. He's the driving force behind the team. He's like the motivator for the whole team. It don't matter. He, he's over there pumping the defense up. He's special teams, offense. He's pumping all them guys up. But I think this game might come down to who has the ball last who makes the fewest mistakes, of course. I mean, that's that's a given. But I think if Florida can have the ball last, I think this could be anywhere from a three to a ten-point win for Florida. Okay. So what's your score? I'm going to go with Florida 27, Oklahoma 21. Okay. I look at these two teams, uh, I think they're very similar. Uh, they're both playing great football when you need to be playing at your best. Uh, of course, then again, they've got like what a month off or so now. It's almost like a month off before you play. And Who's going to be flat coming back? Yeah, in? you know what I mean. Uh, but also, it allows you to heal up some injuries you might have. But you know, I just uh, I hate to say, you know, I'm a big SEC guy, and I and I'll be honest, I want Florida to win. I want Florida to win big. I really like Tebow. Uh, but I've just got this feeling that Oklahoma is going to win. So I'm going to go Oklahoma 24, Florida 21. And indeed, he has turned against us. There you have it, folks. Hey, this, I'm stepping out. This has been the BS Football Forum Extravaganza national championship talk hoping the SEC brings the national title back into the conference where it has been for the last three years let's do it a fourth hey give us your comments let us know what you think that we're stupid or whatever or Everybody, whatever you got there's always people that think you're stupid but come on people have enough respect keep it clean